kitty is laying with me. Her feet on my belly, her belly stretched out in her floof, 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 and her sleepy little face. I have a kitty loving with me. Welcome to the stream. As you can see, I have a paused episode G1 in the background. I'm just double checking that we are fucking live. Jump into there. And yeah, um, this is gonna be me doing some uh, fun stuff. Uh, we are going to be reacting. So I'm just changing up the broadcast information because for some stupid fucking reason. Even though I change it on my stream thing, it's never changing here pretty much. So I'm gonna have to. S yeah, she reacts. Transformers G1. And this is not playing game. I am just chatting. Alright, so welcome to the stream everybody. Um, the whole plan today is I am going to be, I came up with this a bit ago, but I've been watching random G1 episodes except for I've watched like the first, fuck what am I on? I'm on I've watched the first four episodes and I've seen random episodes from then on and reacted to them on stream. So, my whole plan is that instead of just doing the random re episode reactions, I was like, fuck it, I'm just going to watch it chronologically. So, we are here to watch it chronologically. So, I'm on episode 5, which is called Roll For It, which is a good name. Good name, peoples. Did I send out the tweet? tweet? No, I don't think I fucking did. Good job, me, yay. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good at my job, I swear. But yeah, if you all don't know me, I'm Yashiri Reaper. I'm Yashiri Reaper all across the web. I do mostly gaming streams and some art streams, and now I started reacting to Transformer shit. <laughs> I've done all the Prime Wars fucking machinima bullshit. <laughs> I might get some of the more obscure anime to watch, but at the moment... I, th I actually think if I'm gonna do the anime, I think I'd start with Armada. Because that is the one I actually liked. And I remember watching it up until after, like, Starscream's death, basically. As soon as Starscream died, I was like, I'm done. Because <laughs> he was the reason I really liked that show. So I'm going to probably rewatch that one if I'm going to rewatch anything. Uh, and, and, like, watch any of the animes. Because otherwise, I've seen bits of it and I hated it entirely. So if I'm going to do reactions to the animes, it'll be Armada. But for now, we're going to do G1 because G1 is glorious. <laughs> my sister is actually... My sister was born in 1980. She's way older than me. And yeah, she's like 40 now. And this is something like her and her husband watch when they were kids. Like he owns a G1 Optimus Prime figure. And I want it. <laughs> Every time I'm like... Dude, I want it. He's like, no, it's my optimism. Like, <laughs> I want it so bad. This is one of my few special interests that my sister gets on with me on. She's like, I know you like DuckTales, so she, for Christmas, got me... Well, my nephew did. And they're not behind me. They're over on my other shelf. I forgot I moved them. Um, I got 1987 Funko figures of Scrooge and of Webby. And then for transformer stuff i've gotten like in high school she bought me a stainless steel ring i used to wear on my middle finger and it was the autobot insignia and i swear to god if i ever find one that's like that i will buy it up and it was it was cheap because i think she bought it at, like hot topic or something and like it literally broke right around there like completely rusted away because i wore it every day so <laughs> transformers is a big deal to me 
I'm not wearing a Transformers shirt today because actually I got rid of all my Transformers shirts because I bought them when I was a lot bigger. Now I'm wearing a D&D &D one <laughs> from Tea Turtle that says uh, friends who slay together stay together because that's it's my lifestyle. Anyways, we're going to jump into watching G1 before I just ramble all the life away. Yeah, let's go. Oh no. You can do it, I believe in you. S oh, there. there. It's doing its thing. Thomas, let me see I. I'm about to raise their battle to destroy the evil forces of the Decepticon Transformers. <laughs> Just chuck it, Jazz. Transformers, let me see I. Transformers, me, you You stars. <laughs> you almost fucking took him out of the fucking sky. <laughs> sound like they're gonna land in our laps. That's because they are. The dude's face. Decepticons. Run for it. Mayday. Decepticons. Send help. All right, you overgrown bolt buckets. Halt. We've got you covered. My transistors are trembling. Those should have oil in them. These guys should be dead. And also, where do you get off trying to fight a 50 foot giant fucking robot? Wait, but, but the, 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 the. I saw that! I saw that animation error! Yes, I do read you, OP! Your friendly neighborhood Decepticon records. <laughs> oh, Wake TV. Thank you, Wake TV, for subscribe for following me on Twitter and liking my shit. Do your thing, Thundercracker. Fuck him up. All right, fuck you. Okay, little buddy, you feel tough enough for another go round? Sure thing, Ron. Let me at him. Cliff jumper above you. You're about to become. Ron. <laughs> You guys! Oh no, OP! Oh, <laughs> thank you, OP! <laughs> Save them from their own idiocy! Little pretty rainbow. Oh my god, he just transformed so Starscream can pick him up. And, uh, do you think? Streak, prowl, follow them. But don't bite off more than you can shred. <laughs> I will never understand the logic of flying in this goddamn show. There's no logic to it. Randomly they fly, randomly they don't. Decepticons and Autobots is bullshit. I don't understand. It's such a bad continuity error! <laughs> so bad! Oh, my cat has like. Kitty's like, what? Holman, you're yelling! I, I'm coming to make you feel better. It's okay, baby. This is why I want to get an apartment so I can stream in my room and. so I don't disturb the kitty by making loud noises. Come yes. Come on. I know you once. Hello. This is the kitty. Her name is Kitty Raptor Houdini. Yeah. It plays again. <laughs> Who me? Come on, crowd. On a bus, roll. That looks so tiny. And also, look at that fucking nose of goddamn. <laughs> oh, the animation errors and just the the tonal continuity, all the errors. It's beautiful. Megatron, how are you enjoying your time on Cybertron? <laughs> Back to Earth. There's no telling what damage that fool Starscream has done in my absence. Lots! You know, soon enough, Megatron. 
Starscream, Thundercracker, you two look like Optimus Prime ran you through a laser power trash compactor. Cause he did! <laughs> Don't sound so pleased. <laughs> we will attack the laboratory as planned. The antimatter formula will give us the key to ultimate power. Wonderful, Megatron. With your leadership, we can't fail. Leadership, my sign function. <laughs> You're going back and sending you back! Damn it! Kitty, I love you very much, but can you not? Can you not? I back bitches! Hi! <laughs> I love it, I love it when, like, Megatron, like, is so nice to the symbiotes. <laughs> like, he's like, oh, okay, Ravage, come here! <laughs> like, he reaches out his arm for them, it's so cute, he did it, and follow Cybertron too, and it got me swooning, because I think it's adorable. Welcome back! In case you didn't know who did the animation for it, this is Toei! <laughs> this is Toei! <laughs> If you're not an anime geek like myself, you don't know what Toei is. Right. To this is like guys. the people that did Digimon and shit. Words for me? Wow, I've never met an Autobot before. My name's Bobby, <laughs> and somehow I'm barely taller than all these humans, but I fit them both inside my cab. Because I make sense. Also, like, this is back in the 80s, so if you're wondering why, like, randomly this just... I, I don't know. If you don't know, like, in the 80s, it was a big fucking thing to, like, make sure they had representation. So, like, some of the side human characters of this is just like, THIS IS A TOKEN THIS DUDE! come on, Spike. Also, Spike, how old are you?! <laughs> yeah? Yeah, you don't want to be picked up like a baby? You don't want to be picked up like a baby? Then maybe stop attacking my legs. Just another pretty. Oh my god. <laughs> that look. Also, I'm trying to get my cat stuck. Kitty, my character. You stop trying to eat me alive. Look at that shit. Do you see that? So, I don't even know if I'm on camera. Because Kitty is underneath the wheels of my chair. Kitty, I'm moving the chair. Careful. You little dummy. Okay. Face. Chip, I asked you to come by for this. This diskette will let your home computer talk with all Pepsi Brainiac here anytime, day or night. Can't wait to test it out. I've never seen a bird like that before. That's laser beak! It's laser beak! Bumblebee, head for the underground parking entrance. Do you think, Bumblebee? You cute little voice like a motherfucker! They got away. They'll contact 
Optimus Prime. We cannot wait for Starscream. We must attack the laboratory now. See you. I'll my computer and warn Dr. Alcazar at the lab. Prime's already on his way there, and Bumblebee's gonna call Blue Streak and Prowl. How are you talking? You're already driving away! It looks like you're in a totally different area! And so is this! Blue Streak, Prowl, do your thing. We tracked down Starscream's waiting party, Bumblebee, then munching Jets for lunch! I don't like the idea of Megatron getting the anti-matter formula. He can't be trusted! I love the janky yeah, animation. Don't have Prime and Braun to bail you out this time. Ravage, eat him. Say goodbye to your terminals, Autobots. Maybe we should have gone to help Prime after all. Fire! The adorable little Praxians. Oh, Jesus Christ! The Praxians, on their own, have been eaten by the Decepticons. We now return to the <laughs> it's like a cheese, like how tiny Bear Rare and Prowl are. They're teeny, they're babies! Come on, Dr. Alcazar, acknowledge! Are coming to steal the antimatter formula? The antimatter formula, flash creature. I want it. You're too late. I erased it. He lies. He uploaded the formula to someone. I don't know who, but I soon will. Let this human go. We seek another. Oh, wow! Dr. Alcazar sent me the antimatter formula. I've got to keep it safe. <laughs> Stay clear, Blue Streak. Ravage went back to Papa. <laughs> I love you, you sweet baby bean, but you crash like nobody's business. Okay, here's a weird fact. As someone who's been in the fandom for a while, a lot of old fandom shit was picked up from G1. And one of them was Prowl crashing, like, all the fucking time. Which happens all the fucking time! G1 and I don't understand. I'm like, I believe it's also G1 where it came to like Brawl being, Brawl being the tactician and things like that. I'm not entirely certain, but I'm pretty sure it came from G1. It's battle computers down. I must link up with another online computer. Searching. I need to lie online with another computer or else uh, I don't know my brain's gonna fry. I don't fucking know. I don't know what his crashes do. All I know is that he crashes. Oh, he's gonna accidentally do it with this. Don't worry. I'm assuming control now. What the fuck? He's being... His crashes happen, and then he's just like, Humans! Take control of my corporeal form! <laughs> what? <laughs> Say what? <laughs> well, you sure had me execute a fantastic move, Chip. You think just like a regular mainframe. Thanks, Prowl. I'm doing my best. Please keep it up. We make a terrific team. Get him before he can escape! Not so fast! D okay. 
Death Grave is being electrocuted! Why are you directing me to take this action? You'll see in a minute. Oh shit. Just take the fucking formula and fucking shit! Wait till they see what's next! Now this is a human after my own central processor! Oh, it's a smart human! I love them! Just fucking... Ravage, get your big ass back to daddy! We're leaving! Pop out! You make one heck of an Autobot! Finally, I've located the anti-metal formula! Starscream! An outside computer now holds the formula we seek. I will transmit the coordinates. Get the formula, bring it here immediately. <laughs> Chill it at this dude's house. Operation oh no, Decepticons. I've memorized the formula, so once I rip this up, there's no way the Decepticons can learn to make the antimatter. You're too late, Ravage. The information's already been destroyed. Yeah, I'm bringing the human! I have to say that's pretty good capture, huh? Ravage, get your butt over here. <laughs> that's it, that. <laughs> we are leaving. Dr. Alcazar's lab. Why were you blonde? Okay. I thought we'd never get here. He's like, oh shit! <laughs> yeah, thanks, Sarscream, you evil little shit. I love you, you little primal bastard. Oh shit, everyone, transform, get your shit together. Now listen up, boys. I didn't know you could mind melt, Soundwave! I'm learning more about you every fucking day! <laughs> He's just like, finger to the head, and is like, I can read your mind, foolish mortal. <laughs> I am Soundwave, I can do anything! <laughs> God damn, I love it. Did you think you could hide the anti-matter formula inside? The fuck happened to your helm? The fuck happened to your helm? The fuck? <laughs> That just... Oh, no. No, no, no. Your primitive brain. Okay, now it's better. It was just the angle. But you can't use our research for destruction. It's, it's wrong. Get rid of the boy. The time Kill him. I don't fucking care. Throw him out a window. Just get rid of him. <laughs> So where was we? Oh, oh, okay, okay. For a second there, I was about to say no animation glitch, but no, no, he, those are holograms. Okay, uh -huh. honey, I love you very, very much, but you cannot eat me. I know I'm being loud. You should be used to it by now. But she's like, no, no, woman, I'm not. I'm not used to your craziness. You should be. Me and my associates there. Begin Operation Anti Matter and be careful. A fucking rolling boulder. A fucking rolling boulder. God, I love your fucking. I got to love you, Han. Oh, shit, he's a shit, he's a shit, he's a. I remember seeing that. Now, what's that? Good question. The fucks? You're surprisingly good at just being a little asshole and also, honey, no bad. Soundwave will fucking kick your ass for being. Why are they teasing him? I was on the Rumble or Frenzy, I can't remember which. 
<laughs> this is getting like prank. Kitty, no. Leave me alone. Don't, don't wag your tail at me. No, I won't let you. What are you gonna do? Do Jesus Christ, Ravage! <laughs> get get their butt away. Get their butt away. I thought I ordered someone to get rid of him, okay? I do not want to do evil monologues right now. Uh, oh shit. Do your thing, Megs. Oh shit! Fuck. Bumpy. Oh my god, he looks handsome right there. <laughs> he normally looks like a baby, but right in that one shot, he looks like a young dashing hero. What the fuck? Bumpy, you're not supposed to look anything but adorable. Why the fuck do you look good in that one angle? Like, what? What? <laughs> Don't worry, I've come to save you, my son. <laughs> what the fuck is this shit? And Kitty, stop trying to eat me alive! Yeah, go chill on, like, your... your brown bag. You have, like, paper bags. Go chill on them. Peace. Your reunion will be short uh. The, oh, it just, just hot. What the fuck was that? The fuck was that? <laughs> <laughs> you fucking Yoshi them! <laughs> but as a car and why are, why did you transform into a car to drive up human staircases? <laughs> We go now. See there, all of you. Why are you going up the stairs? We. Honey, I love you. You dumb little bitch. Oh, he's like, yeah, let's go. <laughs> Optimus fucking Prime is here. Uh, they're, they're, they're the boys. Sunstreaker, where did you, where did you come from? Sunstreaker. And also, why do you keep sending Ratchet and he's goddamn medic? <laughs> but also, Sunstreaker, where, where the fuck did you come from? The Transformers will return after these. Just no answers. You just, they just appear. There's no explanation for this bullshit. God damn it. Uh, you injured your your shoulder. For the moment, we will return to headquarters for repairs. Autobots, transform. Apparently, like G1. For Peter Cullen, and they described it as a lot of yelling. Oh shit! You guys do not look good! <laughs> they all look kinda fucked up. I just like, come on, I'll fix you up. You little shits. Destruction of the Autobots is now at hand. Powered by antimatter energon cubes, I will reduce them to dust molecules. Of course you will. Of course you will, you fucking little bastard. Oh. Ratchet, what? Ratchet, why did you disappear? You were there. You were there. You were not. Dad, you and Teleport shit. Uh, this is all my fault. Megatron would never have gotten the antimatter formula if I hadn't memorized it. There's no way you could have erased your brain. Anyway, I got a much better use for it. There's a little project I'm working on, and I think you two guys can help. You're coming with me! We're gonna do science! We're in science! Breaking things and making things! Total victory shall be mine! I shall rule the world! 
fix my servos. Brothers, why are you arm wrestling? Ratchet, what the fuck happened? Teletran just picked up the Decepticons. They're on their way. I like how the twins are just arm wrestling for no fucking reason, arm behind their back, not even on a table, just <laughs> We're the only ones that can do it. They're within attack range. When we're done with them, they're gonna wish they'd never been assembled. You go, boys. Go, you little Lambo twin motherfuckers. Is this a jet judo? <laughs> jet judo, jet judo, jet judo. Gotta ride some fucking jets and fucking make them crash. <laughs> Cause we're crazy little fuckers. <laughs> Sideswipe's like, what? No, no. Sideswipe. You say that. <laughs> that jet judo needs a bit more work. I like how they have parachutes. <laughs> These fuckers are so eager to jump on fucking flyers and fucking take them down. <laughs> that they're like, y both of you get parachutes. Because <laughs> neither of you can be trusted. And how'd they fly in the first place? And also. Fucking hell. Are you buried or is your lower half gone? I'm curious. <laughs> I like how both of his arms are moving in sync and he's only using one of them to fire a Megatron. Oh, Jesus Christ. We're gonna do this. We're doing science. Oh, he's like, alright, we're doing science. Get the antimatter gun. It's Megatron. <laughs> I still find it so weird that if anybody turns to fucking guns and other people shoot, <laughs> there's a good reason. There's so much porn. <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit! I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but yeah, there's there's so much. There's so much. It's so bad. Oh god. Oh god, okay. This is why I'm live reacting to G1, because G1 gets me like this, because I'm like... <laughs> Being in the fandom, even though I haven't seen every episode of this, I've seen random ones, and I've seen the movie, I know a good chunk of, like, the themes and things, and I'm like, oh, this is where this fucking came from. <laughs> you fucking jackhammering his fucking... Warp? What are you doing? Wheelchair! Chip! What the fuck are you doing? Oh! Shit! Detonator! Not if Wheel Jack's invention works, you won't! Computer override accomplished. New target selected. Spike! We did it! We were a prayer gun to the set the gun! Voice. How'd that go, Megatron? You feeling good? It's cause you're all stupid! We're leaving! See you later, fuckers! Just, just pick up the whole fucking kid and put him on his shoulder! Really? You sure did. You may not be an Autobot, but when you rolled for broke back there, you sure could have fooled me. We're proud to have you as our friend. One small boy came between me and mastery of the universe. But soon revenge and victory will be mine. 
Like Tron's like, I gotta fuck kill this kid. <laughs> I'm so glad I got to see Judge fucking Juno in action! But yeah. It is so weird just seeing, like, the number one, the graphical issues, continuity issues. Just the whole cheesiness of this era of TV. Plus, being in the fandom and knowing kind of part of these things, always, and being like, oh shit, this is where it came from. Like, I'm pretty sure this is the only a like universe where both the twins are in it, and they're both Lamborghinis. But, like, for a long time, people called them the Lambo Twins. And I still refer to them as the Lambo Twins. <laughs> because they're both Lamborghinis. <laughs> this show... Okay, here's a weird fact. Transformers is the only reason I know any form of cars. Normally, I would never know any fucking thing about cars, but I was like, I'm like, oh, that's a Mini Cooper. Oh, that's a Volkswagen Beetle. Oh, that's an Austin Martin. If you don't know, um, Transformers Prime knockout is a fucking Austin fucking Martin. And a custom one at that. All right, I'll be, I'll be right back. I drank way too much soda before I start streaming. Bambi! Sorry about that. I, I should not have drank so much fucking water earlier. But to be fair, I was eating spicy dinner food, so. Yes. That's cool. Divide and conquer. Swimmers, let them meet the eye. And the bots raise their battles to destroy the evil forces of the Decepticons. Transformers, that meets the eye. Transformers, that meets the eye. Transformers. So beautiful. So corny. Factories are busy manufacturing weapons to be used against the greatest threat the world has ever known. Evil, super powerful robots. The enemy! <laughs> oh, if fuck, that's great. If we use computer skills to step up our efficiency chip, we'll be able to double our weapons output. I'll give it a try, sir. Huh. Oh, goddamn. Set the cuts! Wait. They change from armed guards to random workers. Decepticons. Skywalk, Thundercracker, and Starscream! <laughs> the Elite Thrawn! <laughs> Humans run funny, don't they, Starscream? Uh, look out behind you! Drain this factory of its energy at once! That's supposed to be Skywarp. 
that teleporting this is the thing in G1 they had a terrible thing for miscoloring the seekers the teleporting was supposed to be Skywarp Skywarp is the one that can teleport not what it was Starscream's colors why they do this Uh, yeah, yeah, see, it like transfer and... Don't cash in your computer chips yet, sir. There may still be a few buttons we can push. Any luck, Optimus Prime? Did you figure out where the Decepticon space bridge will show up next? Fun fact. Optimus and Ironhide are both voiced by the state characters. Same with Megatron and Soundwave are voiced by the same voice actor. Peter Cullen did these two, and Frank Welker did Soundwave and Megatron, and he also did Shockwave, I think. I don't know. Maybe he's not. I'm afraid not, Ironhide. I've scanned the area where the bridge first appeared, but my readouts came up to zero. We might as well head back to Autobot headquarters, Prime. Wait. A distress signal from Chip Chase at the munitions plant. Decepticons attacking. Autobots, transform and meet me there. We're going! Get in, kid! Bill <laughs> Jack, Bull Beast, no, wait, no, Sunstreaker, Ironhead. There it is, Starscream. Every last micro spark of energy we could wring from the place. I'm afraid your button pushing was too little, too late. No, don't worry. Did come. Decepticon headquarters. I love, I love the Seekers, like, their frames, <laughs> and the fact that, like, most of the, like, <laughs> the hips, they're just like, meh, <laughs> like, their chest is like, meh, <laughs> it's always a pretty extreme angle. Acknowledge, Megatron. Acknowledge me, you fucking prick! <laughs> I'm sorry, I really need to say that again. Acknowledge me! <laughs> no. I need to get Starscream. Acknowledge me, Megatron! <laughs> Complete success! Complete success! What was that? What was that? As you command, Megatron. But surely you wish to commend me for my effort. STOP BEING A SUCKER STARSCREAM! <laughs> Surely you wish to commend me on my efforts! <laughs> Shut the fuck up, Starscream! You either want to kill him, or you want his praise! Pick one. Pick one. After all, I was... Autobots. Shit! Like how randomly Starscream's voice sounds nothing like Starscream's voice. Optimus Prime? When it's more like Optimus Prime! <laughs> I don't know. Does anyone else hear that? Or it's just like randomly, it does not sound like Starscream. Starscream has more of a fist to its voice. And randomly it's like, Optimus Prime? It's like, Starscream. Are you in there? Is, do you actually just put up a voice? Is that your real voice? <laughs> Very perceptive. You out <laughs> three to one. Gang up and destroy him. <laughs> See? This is back. I'm with you. <laughs> The boys. You've got some fucking under <laughs> and Sarah Screen's just gonna fucking tackle him. Are you trying to pick up 
Arthur's friend's goddamn shotgun. What do you think, kitty? We're here. Ironhide, I love you. Oh, Pete, are you okay? <laughs> Badly damaged. Fucking got shocked. Can you repair me? I hope so, but not here. Can you still transform? I'll try. I'll try. Give me a minute, please. I just got my ass shocked. Fused. Mobility limited. Part replacement essential. Honey, I love you very, very much. But can you not nestle my legs while I'm trying to react? Lighten up, you guys. Optimus is gonna pull through. He's he's got to. He's got to. <laughs> I fucking love it. He's like, no, Dad can't die. <laughs> Just so you guys know, like, Kitty, it's okay. I'm not gonna touch you. What is the condition of Optimus Prime? He has been permanently deactivated. We saw him fall. Fall, yes, but can you guarantee his laser core was extinguished? I must be- His laser core was extinguished. <laughs> oh, some of these charges have never been used ever since. And also, Kitty, 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 I require that you stop trying to eat me, okay? Okay? Laser beak, that's fine on them. I need to know if this fucker's actually dead. Fly to Autobot headquarters and learn the true condition of Optimus Prime. Go find out if he's dead. Oh. He'll have more to fear if he refuses to obey me. If Optimus Prime's laser core was in fact extinguished, we shall destroy the accursed Autobots, and none shall stand between us. And our conquest of the universe. Oh, you're just gonna, just gonna say stuff on the, my broad shoulder. Oh, wait, how you doing? Let's be. I don't know, fellas. It looks bad. Excellent. <laughs> Excellent. He's dying. Hydraulics are still functioning. Weaker. Electro pulse fading. He's doomed. I know it. I can feel it in my data bank. Shut the fuck up, whoever you are. <laughs> Kitty. Nuts to that. There's gotta be something we can do. Isn't there, Dad? I don't know, son. Now laser beak finish him off! Laser beak kill him! I wish Optimus Prime to die! What the? It's laser beak! Stop! Laser beak finish him off! Shit! Laser beak! You little fuck! Shit! Explode an OP. <laughs> Luckily I know he can't die until the movie. <laughs> I can only really imagine how fucked up this would be for kids, because they're in the movie, like, apparently that was, like, the biggest heartbreak any kid had ever felt. They're like, YOU KILLED HIM! Okay, we're fine, Dad. What about Optimus Prime? What about OP? Is he okay? But energy draining fast. They sure don't build them like that anymore. Ratchet, how long do we have before his energy drains away completely? Not long. Unless I can replace this. Hmm. A Cosmetron. I have an extra one of these. Not here. Hey, talk to me. Talk to me. Point me in the right direction. It's okay, like talk to me. Talk to me. Tell me who it is. Cosmotron I'm talking about is in my old workshop on Cybertron. Cybertron? And to make matters worse, the Decepticons put a computerized lock on the door. I knew it was hopeless. I just knew. Shut the fuck up. Ironhead. Thank you. Thank you for shutting up where the fuck that guy is. 
You don't! You can't do it! Motherfucker, shut up! You don't know OP! He's he's a beast! This, this is not a man, this is a myth! Sounds like I've just volunteered to pick a lock. Well, what are we waiting for? I always wanted to visit another planet. Kid. Without Optimus Prime leading them, the Autobots will be helpless. And why Without we attack them now, leader? It's usually good strategy. We attack when I so order, Starscream. I mean, to be fair, he is kind of right. If you fuck them up now, they're Where fucked. Space bridge Within 72 billion astroseconds at these coordinates. Broadcast visual representation. Excellent shockwave. But how are we gonna get to Cybertron in time, kid? Even Prime couldn't find a clue to the whereabouts of the next space bridge. But Optimus Prime didn't use the greatest detective on Earth. Teletran 1. By feeding Teletran 1 all the data we have about the space bridge's last appearance, I might get it to predict where the bridge will appear next. Hey, just like Sherlock Holmes with floppy disks. Come on, Teletran. Just like Sherlock Holmes with floppy disks. Sherlock Holmes with floppy disks! <laughs> that, that sentence was getting my old speech of fediment. Talents are wasted on this project. I should be in full command of everything. That's game, I love you. <laughs> I love you, you evil little bastard. <laughs> but for the most part, every time they tell you you want to be in sole command, you've kind of fucking failed. <laughs> I love you, but you're shit at your job. Hey, Starscream. Hey, I thought we needed a driver to haul this stuff across the space bridge. We do. No, please, not me. No. Yeah, you're getting in. Nice journey, warrior. Say hi to the old gang on Cybertron. See you later, bitch. And he crashed. Really? None of these people know how to fly. No wonder Shockwave is done with his existence. Oh, no. No, they didn't. They didn't blow it up. Shockwave to Megatron. Energon cubes received. And I now have a pet. You and Teletran are some hot team. I'm going to experiment on you. It will be glorious. <laughs> I like how it looks like they said one part of reflector, but I don't. The flash shorted my optic sensors. Oh shit! Lightning! Follow me! You're about to get hit by a fucking tree! Wake up! Oh Rumble, you, you sweet baby bean. Sorry, it's gonna be like fucking tree! Change the Thundercracker for some fucking reason. Why are the colors so bad for the show? There are just so many graphical it glitches, uh, like animation errors, that are linked to colors. Bye. Oh, Starscream. Uh, oh, shit. Did you just freeze him? Did you just freeze Starscream? Oh, shit. You've all been combined back into one, and Rumble, you're getting your ass kicked. Well done. Return to headquarters immediately if I'm- Starscream, why are you TC again? Further orders.
So this place just explodes afterwards. That's that's a great thing to know. Damn yeah, thanks. Shockwave. Damn. Drive off, Aaron. See you later, bitch. <laughs> I know she should go. Yeah. <sighs> has been breached. Destroy all intruders with rain. Acid rain. Acid rain, sunstorm, and I can't remember the other one. I did it. Now, if my detectors can only find that Cosmo, what you call it? Now if I just remember how to fucking speak! Don't do it dum dum! I can't imagine letting a kid out into acid rain would be any better than on bots. To be fair, I'm pretty sure Chip is now dead. <laughs> Just saying. If it's corrosive enough for you, it's corrosive enough for him. <laughs> Just saying. Or is it not technically acid rain? It's just like something else. It's just like ah, it only affects us. Which is doubtful. But still. B. Everything is going according to my plan. The Autobots are without their mighty leader, and four of their number have been vanquished on Cybertron. Then I humbly suggest. We attack their base now while we have the advantage! For one star scream, we agree! For once we agree! Let's go! <laughs> What's the verdict, Wheeljack? We've done all we can, Sparkplug. Optimus Prime needs a new Cosmotron, and if we don't get one soon, all hope is lost. How you guys doing with the... Oh, they're just gonna go attack, I guess. Damn it! We can't fail. Optimus Prime, our, our world, the whole universe depends on us. Fail, Chip. Acid storm disabled circuit tree. No one's ever really disabled as long as he has courage. Uh. Shut the Get out of here! I mean, to be fair, it is coming from an actually disabled character, but still, that is a cheesy fucking line. <sighs> well, guys, do we quit or fight? Maybe I still have enough power left. <sighs> I love this man. Hi, Trailbreaker. Trailbreaker. I goddamn love you! <laughs> I was made to love you by more than means the eye, because you're a raging alcoholic <laughs> who will literally kill us off for a force field! God damn! To shield us from this killer rain! Way to go, Trailbreaker! Now your automatic repair systems can put you back in shape! And while they work, I'll take care of our three Raymakers! Well, there we are. I'm gonna do what I always do, which is shoot fuckers. Acid or otherwise. I'm really feeling better. Like I just stepped off the assembly line. All right, let's stop talking and save Optimus. Transform and roll for his life. 
You guys are adorable. Don't strain your linkage. Kyle says free. The fools, they're back. They'll never reach us as functional mechanisms. Shockwave, I love you. But you're a dumbass. I mean, you're a genius. <laughs> oh my god, I can't remember what was it was a comic where they're talking about, like, uh, was, like, lines or something, and he's talking about a project, and Sunscreen's like, oh, this thing is more cut and infernally better, and he's like, you know nothing. <laughs> and he's like, I graduated with high odds, I was a fellow Victorian in science school, and he's like, what science? He's like, political science. Yes, political science, so get out! <laughs> And that shit fuels me. <laughs> That's my energy! Let's go! Back! Just drop gas! Let's go! But we still have to get the Cosmotron to Optimus Prime. How fast can you go, Bumblebee? Hold on to your teeth! My mother actually sorry, used to own a uh, Volkswagen Sometimes Beetle. Nothing you do makes any difference. Optimus Prime? Sometimes, son! You gotta die! <laughs> I'm sorry, I grim. <laughs> Let's go. Dad? Telegram 1 security alarm. We're being attacked. Decepticons. Looks like all of them. Oh, we're doomed. We yes! Yes, you're in charge! Decepticons? <laughs> we can't go down without trying. Prime would want us to go for it. Kid, why are you holding a gun? Jess, why did you... What? How, how weak were you holding that gun that a child could take it? I have questions, Jess. No matter what the odds. Well, are you with me? Or do I fight this battle alone? Son, you can't. But we can. We get your message, Spike. Autobots transform. I wish it had been Jess. And to be honest... I'll stay here to guard Optimus Prime. You guys fight! We're just gonna stay here and uh, make sure he doesn't die, you know? <laughs> Wait, the f Okay, okay, I think... I think I know what was going on there, but if not, it was an animation glitch. Can you get a fix on the enemy's location, Hound? Radar scope detects Decepticons in close proximity. How Why is the kid still have a gun?! <laughs> Kid, the recoil on that would send you to death. I am 99% sure. Forget the radar, here they come! Alright guys, let them have it! That should kill you. You do not have the strength to handle that kind of recoil. TC just got smacked in the fucking Ravage, I was just like, I'm gonna eat a human! Go! Ravage. I'm gonna eat a human! I'm gonna eat a human! Cause I'm goddamn Ravage! <laughs> Sides what? What are you doing? Why are you? Why are you, Oh no! You're shooting fire out of somewhere. I don't know. Out of your tent. I don't know. <laughs> Let's transform you, fucking little dick. Did you get the Cosmotron? Yeah. I just hope it's not too late. Get in, kid. Jesus Christ. That's great! We got the gizmo! Hand them the gizmo! Hand them the gizmo! <laughs> what? You saw that. You saw Ratchet. There's so many errors. <laughs> Jazzy, are you okay? 
in the universe who'll challenge the might of Megatron. And the purse. One Megatron. Arthur's Prime. I'm here. <laughs> Prime he lives. Our leader's back. Of course he lives. Your challenge, leader. The battle code requires you to engage him. In the battle code requires you to engage him. In the There's a battle code. You're, there's a battle code! And Starscream, I know you're just doing this because you're like, I just want to see you get your ass kicked. Come on. <laughs> Come on. You, you, the, he, he challenged you. you. You gotta go fight him now, I guess. <laughs> In combat, alone. Then it's just the two of us, Megatron. Come fight me, bitch! <laughs> I'll win. Oh, shit! Oh, Peach just dove at him! You do your thing! Do your thing, boys! Fucking beat the shit out of each other because that's what you do. How unfortunate. If you cannot fight your opponent yourself, you are not fit to be our leader. I am the only super. Starscream, I goddamn love you, but this is this is the dumbest shit I've ever heard. <laughs> the leader anyway. Megatron's like, you know what? I'm gonna just keep fighting him in a spike! <laughs> Megatron, do you yield? Bitch! I'm just gonna step on your fucking hand! Retreat and take our leader back for repairs. I guess that takes care of the Decepticons. For today! Oh, they'll be back. I just know it. Of course they fucking back. <laughs> He just hurt his goddamn pride. Cause he realized he's the older of the old men in that fight. <laughs> oh my god. But yeah. This is the normal shit you get together when you watch this shit like this. Watch a couple more, and then we'll be. All set to go. We're gonna do fire in whatever. And we'll skip SOS Dinobots because I've already reacted to that one. Oh, the Misty Eye. Autobots race their battle to destroy the evil forces of the Decepticons. Transformers. Oh, the Misty Eye. Transformers. Robotons. Transformers! It's now winters! I'm gonna make a snowbot! Make it very tall! Snowbot. Jazz! Jazz, what the fuck?! I love you, Jazz! <laughs> Jazz is like, I was waiting there for for the longest time. I wanted to do this. <laughs> he's so playful. He's so goddamn cute. Okay, spheroid projectiles ready. Fire! Snowball fight! <laughs> <laughs> hey, guys. That's snow fair. Ratchet, watch out for Bumblebee. Okay, Spike, you rat on me. I'll split 
Okay, they're acknowledging that this should not be happening, and also, oh, he's like global warming. <laughs> Appreciated. Teletran One, activate all atmospheric sensors for a worldwide weather report. Temperatures now 40 degrees below normal and falling rapidly. Entire planet freezing. The heat energy from the Earth's core is somehow being drained away. Megatron and the Decepticons. I bet they're behind this. Look! The snow in Tahiti! <laughs> what are they do? Crystals? Tunnel blasting completed! Lay in the new pipe! Oh, we got crystals? Why are there crystals in the core? What the fuck is going on? Wait. Oh, this is Skyfire's episode! Oh, yeah! Sorry. Locating the crystal shaft leading to the Earth's core was the hard part, but pumping the heat energy out is simplicity itself. Soon this entire planet will freeze into an icy tomb. And we will return to Cybertron with enough energon cubes to dominate the universe. Rumble? Is the big bad ice too tough for you? Are you are making him angry? You're like, you look better when you're angry! I'm just gonna stand here and insult you! Skywalk! Skywalk! You baby! Skywalk! Poppy, honey! I hate everything about this! Something's frozen in the ice. Why are you standing around like lumps at a smelter? There's work to do. We... we found something. Uh. <laughs> I love the surprise Pikachu faces that they make in this show. <laughs> There's so many faces where you're just like, oh my god. Oh my god, yeah. You did. Starscream, I want a clearer look. You shall have it, leader. It appears. I still find it so weird that occasionally Starscream's like, Yes, yes, my leader. And not occasionally, he's like, I will stab you in the skin. <laughs> and with that's a part of your corpse. <laughs> Starscream, you got dead sooner. <laughs> With his size and probable strength, he will make an excellent Decepticon! <laughs> Finally, someone new! I'm sick of these fuckers! <laughs> Abnormally large energy expenditure in the Arctic Circle. Thank you, Teletran. What's that weird light the Sky Spy just passed over? Lost at level. Uh, then we found the source of Earth's problem. Maybe some kind of... Giant green crystal! Decepticon activity sighted. If we don't stop Megatron and his bunch, the Earth is doomed. Let's go! Transform and roll out! Kid, why are you trying to come? Hope he's like we got this. Arctic circle, here we come. What are you just gonna drive there? I guess so. <laughs> get drive to the Arctic Circle. Why the fuck not? Oh hi! Hi you big gentle bean! <laughs> I 
I'm like in Siege where you're a giant gentle monster. <laughs> I'll beat the shit out of anyone who says something against me. This one's like, I'm gonna pick the flowers. <laughs> oh, that's like, I know this bitch! Hey, what are you doing? What are you doing down here? You being cute? Yeah, you being cute? Anything sending a gun. <laughs> That's when you know you're dedicated to being evil, even your medical tools that look like weapons of mass destruction. And probably are also used as weapons of mass destruction. <laughs> Hi, baby. You're so sweet, nuzzling me, but I do not appreciate it when I'm in the middle of watching something, okay? So yes. Oh, no, no, you're gonna bite me. No. Ah. Now you're gonna bite me. Hmm? You don't need to bite me. You do not need to bite me. Starscream, why are you so concerned about this creature? I've never seen you care, to be quite honest, and it's actually frightening me. Why the fuck do you give a shit? <laughs> I, I, I need to know now. Because I knew him once, a long time ago on Cybertron. Again, this time a million The fuck are you? Okay. You can just do this shit, I guess. Wait, you know people? <laughs> you don't just shank everyone? I, I believe I misjudged you! <laughs> yeah, I thought you were just a little maniac that I picked up off the street that was killing everyone he ever knew. Apparently you actually had friends. <laughs> Shit! You had friends! I'm learning new things about you. <laughs> So weird. <laughs> He's got a TV in his brain. <laughs> you know what? I I could tell you myself, but to be honest, uh, he's got TV in his brain. Why would fucking watch that? I don't know. Then I'm gonna dub over it. You sound so robotic! <laughs> I have questions. Oh, not there. No, oh, I forgot her nail, dude. Sorry. We detected no intelligent life on the surface, but Skyfire insisted we look closer. A polar windstorm came up suddenly, and Skyfire and I were separated. I circled half the globe searching for him, but he was gone. And now, millions of Earth years later, you have found him. Ah, oh, so this is your uh, boyfriend! Well, uh, shit! <laughs> you actually give a shit about things, it's... Weird. I don't like it. <laughs> I kind of want to kill him right now just to make you go back to my normal, but uh, we're just gonna see where this goes! <laughs> I 
surprise. It's like, surprise Pikachu fist. Surprise Pikachu fist. <laughs> so I like, shit, my bitch is living. <laughs> my bitch lives. You have rescued me, but where am I? My, my ship and heart can't handle this. My ship and heart can't handle this. You don't understand. Uh, one of the major ships. There are tons of major ships, but one of the major ones of Starscream is with Skyfire. Which is why a lot of people were insulted with, with having and say they're like, no! No! They're bitter ex lovers at the worst! <laughs> they're like, yeah. <laughs> this Go is ahead. not Cybertron. No. This is Earth. Where you crashed many years ago. Out of my way, bitch! I wish to speak to the big one. <laughs> so he's your boyfriend. What? He looks about my size. Let's go. <laughs> I'm sorry. Let's keep going. Supreme leader of all Decepticons. We are on this planet to collect the energy we need to revive Cybertron and conquer the universe. And the Autobots are now our enemies. Here they are, Optimus. Aurora Borealis, the Northern Lights. Aurora Borealis? Concentrated directly in your kitchen. Sorry. Um. <laughs> Actually, let's keep going. Aren't they terrific? And dude, they're very pleasing. But we're kinda here to kick some ass, so uh, could not talk about the pretty scenery. You, Skyfire, become a member of the exalted Decepticon forces. Exalted or insulted? <laughs> Cause it sounded in between both those two words. And they mean totally different things. Hail Cybertron! Oh, that's what they're doing. This bullshit. <laughs> Shank yourself in the tit. <laughs> Hail Cybertron! <laughs> Hail Cybertron! And destruction to all Autobots! Destruction. Put him on guard patrol! Are you happier being a warrior than a scientist? So who gave him a blaster? Did anyone teach him how to fire one? He was a scientist. Did anyone teach him how to fire a gun? Did anyone? Just the question. Something's approaching from the south. Several unusual vehicles. Earth mechanisms, perhaps. It seems the time has come for me to make the change from science to war. Get damn cute. 
And I know it's all it's just the fandom that's making him so cute in my head right now. Because what he's saying is, I'm, I'm going to change from being a scientist to killing people, but in my brain it's going, Aw, you sweet bean! <laughs> and he is. We are near the location of the energy train. Hi. What is that? Oh. He's a terrible... <laughs> How can identify yourselves, bitches? <laughs> I love how huge he is! He's, he's massive! He's a goddamn titan! Look at you, Jazz. You're already ready. <laughs> Jazz is like, I got this! <laughs> I got this! <laughs> So precious. We now return to the Transformers. He's like, I'll do this for you, Starscream. <laughs> I like how the logo just changes color randomly too. And that's just that's just a, it's just a fact of life at this point. Ironhide. You precious bean. He's so, he's like I hear someone calling for help. I must do my duty. <laughs> Strange voices must be coming from Earth creatures. They try to. Keep going. Keep your big mitts off of me. Let go of us, please. Help, Optimus Prime. Why are you so frightened? I will not harm you. Then why are you wearing the Decepticon symbol? Only the evil Autobots need fear me. The Autobots are not evil, they're good. I hate it. I hate this trope. And I'm like, uh, the, the, um, the evil Autobots may fear me. You're evil! Oh shit. <laughs> Stupid trope. <laughs> At the same time. This man is a precious bean, and he's like, but my lover told me. <laughs> They're fighting to protect our planet and all us humans. He's right. You Decepticons are the real monsters. No, no, that can't be true. I'll prove we are not evil. I'll take you to Megatron, my leader. He'll show you that you have nothing to fear. Skyfire, what the fuck? He's like, oh no no no! I'll take you to I'll take you to Megatron. He'll tell you. Come on, let's go. I'll I'll make sure you guys are safe. Don't worry. We'll get you back home, okay? <laughs> Skyfire is like the gentlest of giants, and I love him. He's like a massive, even compared to all the other Autobots. He's like, D -d -d he's so big, so big. Oh no, you might hit Spike and Spark Plug. We've got to find a safer way to rescue them. If there is one. She's like, no one will we'll, we'll shoot them by accident. These two Autobot sympathizers may prove useful to our cars. Deal with them, Starscream. Get away with this Decepticron! Optimus Prime will save us! I promised the Earth creatures no harm would come to them. This is wrong. 
Then you overstepped your authority. Who are you to offer safety to our enemies, Skyfire? Enemies? But they are my... my friends. Do not interfere! <laughs> I like how in the shot he is he's so big he's like he makes them look the size of humans. It's it's insane how big this mech is. He's huge and I live for it. I don't understand. The puny flesh creatures are insignificant. Once they cease being useful to us, they will be terminated. My function is to further science and learning. Not to destroy innocent life forms. Skyfire, I love you, you precious billion! Autobots, transform. Transform. We're going. Move in quickly and secure your positions. Go! Let that little fucking Volkswagen boys go first. What's wrong? Gears moving! I got a tingle in my sensor legs. Like we might be falling right into a trap. No, you're about to fall into fucking ice. All of you, to be quite honest. Freezing weather's icing my relays. My electro scanner says that big Decepticon took spike and spark plug this way. Come on, guys. No sign of hiding the others, Optimus. You suppose they're lost? Awesome. Why are you floating? Why are you floating? Why are you floating? Be why are you floating? Are you flying? Please help! Spike and spark plug. Cliff Jumper. is like Cliff Jumper for the love of. And look, his symbol's purple for some damn reason. But like, <laughs> Cliff is going off on himself again because uh, he's got complex, I think. Decepticons find us. Ah, the work goes well. Soon we will have all the Energon cubes we need. Then we'll soon return to Cybertron and leave this dead planet of ice behind us? Yes, Starscream. Unless we are foolish enough to be careless. Seize those Autobots! More surprise Pikachu faces, courtesy of Ratchet and Ironhide. Dispose of them immediately. With pleasure, Megatron. Soundwave, check for more Autobots in the vicinity at once. Ravage, <laughs> go do your thing, my boy. Do your thing, my son. Okay, fight. We've been searching these tunnels for astro minutes and still no iron hide. Maybe we all split up or double back. We'll maintain the prearranged search pattern. We don't want to roll around in circles. That takes too long, Optimus. I gotta move. Cliff! Cliff! You're the reason the Decepticons weren't killed in like episode two. <laughs> so you shut the fuck up. I understand your inferiority complex is big. All y'all transform, please. I'll deal with the with the fucking cat, okay? That's what I call stopping him cold. One Decepticon down and a whole mess to go. Jazz, I love you. Those years under the ice diminished your loyalty coefficient, Skyfire. But because of our old friendship, I shall be generous. You may have the pleasure of melting down these Autobots. But I'm a scientist, not an executioner. I am your superior. I order you 
contaminate them? No, I will not. They have done no wrong. But you have freedom! I love you. Fan <laughs> girl me hates this. Starscream, your inferiority complex is you love this man. <laughs> Just gonna play again. Cry at the fact that I hope this sends you on the scrap metal! <laughs> and you! You! Don't betray me! You're the only one I have left! Skyfire, you and Starscream saw one of Hound's holograms. Then you are functioning good. Oh. Skyfire, you poor bean. I want to give him a hug. And the overwhelming need to hug this man. You're functioning. I sure hope we'll be able to say the same for you. Let's get him behind some cover and start working. Move him, and I'll fix him up, okay? He's a sweet bean, and I like him. I don't really like you most of the time, but I like him. <laughs> badly damaged. I don't get it. Why repair a Decepticon? He tried to save us, and Starscream blasted him for it. Well, that's all I can do. Now it's a matter of time and luck. Ravage. Let's make, uh, let's make doing a thing. I like how he's just play with it. He's like, look at it, beautiful. <laughs> it's great. You failed to terminate the other ones. Laser beakers inform me they are still functional. Hounds, holograms, they tricked me. But we shall not be fooled a second time. This We're not going to fail again, you fucking bitch. You take your throne with you, you seem to do slightly better with them. Just dropping fucking bombs on them, cause that's what you do. Medic! You shot a medic! You dicks! Time for reinforcements. Skywarp's like, uh, Thundercracker, you weren't hit! What happened there?! Eh. You guys are just taking fucking crystals to beat the shit out of each other? Good you- you can rotate your hips to 180 degrees! And 360, damn! That's some skills. Why did Optimus' mouth face move when they were speaking? Was Optimus like, dude, dude, help? <laughs> Once and for all, I take no orders from you. You rip it off. Oh, that's so terrible! <laughs> he, oh, who gave it to him? Was it Ratchet? Oh, Ratchet, you're a sweet bean. Also, I like how it's that easy. <laughs> Just <laughs> like it's paper. <laughs> Autobot now. Check the bitch! <laughs> Chuck the bitch! Chuck the bitch! 
Chuck the bitch! You forget, Starscream! I can transform too! Time to even the score, friend! Melt him in the burner, Skyfire! Take him apart! Where are you, Trigger? Show yourself! He's right above you! Skyfire is bigger. <laughs> Skyfire is losing altitude. What's he doing? He should try to land. Just one last blast. Ow. Stasis again knows better. You risked everything to save us and the Earth. The energy drain has been stopped. The Earth will heat up again, and the Decepticons are defeated. But Skyfire is is gone. He won't be forgotten, Spike. He will live forever, so long as freedom exists. We shall remember you, Skyfire. We shall remember. You dick waffles! I bury him! You dick waffles! All of you. You let them buried. I mean, you get them at some point, I know that. But still! They just let them buried! You dicks! You massive dicks! Yeah, not gonna start another episode. <laughs> I think we're good for that. But yeah, G1 is a fun show to react to. It gets a lot of reactions out of me. <laughs> this is something like every couple seconds I almost want to hit pause and just have a full rant reaction to it, but it's great. It's great. It's great. It's, it's a good show to react to because it's, it's, it's one of the shows like, um, when I grew up, Television Retro was just starting to become a thing. And uh, I grew up watching a lot of shows that were, like, a bit before my time, because my sister grew up in the 80s, 90s, and she was like, I'm going to pass down everything I want to do you. So, I used to watch a lot of What's New Scooby-Doo. Like, all, all the Scooby-Doo shit. I watched all of it. The Monster School one, yeah, I watched it all. And then, uh, she got me to watch... Wasn't he man? What was it? What was it? The original Milo Pony. My day 80s one. I saw a couple episodes of this when I was a kid. In the movie. Um, Skeletor, like He Man and Skeletor, I saw a good deal of that. The Jetsons, the Flintstones. I saw a lot of early, early this stuff, and I love it. And this show, these kind of shows always get me, and I love them. Like. <laughs> I don't know. This this is just a fun show. Like, I don't think a lot of it's not good critically, but as a fan of Transformers, this shit is the best. Uh, this is the greatest. I watched the first three episodes with uh, my sister Chrissy, who's it's not my eldest sister, but he's my she's my trans transgender sister, and well, we watched the first ep three episodes. So she's like, what is this? I'm like, it's great. She's like, I don't know what the fuck's going on. I'm like, I know. It's perfect. <laughs> like, uh, it's great. It makes me laugh. It makes me smile. It makes me happy. And since I have to go back to work in the, the work for the next six days in a row, this is good. <laughs> so anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like my streams here, go follow me here on Twitch. I also post all these streams eventually onto my YouTube channel, so if you want to watch backlogs of any of my other streams, go check them out there. I know that you hear me, but all across the web, I write fan fiction, I do web comics, I do fan art over on Twitter, Instagram, and DeviantArt. 
And I do fanfictions on AO3 and fanfiction.net. Uh, I do streaming here. I do stuff on TikTok, which is mostly kit, cat videos, random voice acting stuff, random. Just random shit, and then stream highlights. And um, if there's anything you'd like to see me react to, like if there's a <laughs> weird, obscure Transformers shit I have yet watch it, have yet to watch, and you want me to watch it, tell me. I will gladly react to that shit. Anyways, um, thank you guys so very much for watching. If you want to support me here on the internet and everything I do, subscribe to me here on Twitch, and you can also check out my coffee page. It is ko-fi.com/shereaper. That's ko-fi. Dot com slash Shira Reaper. I'm currently saving up to get myself a full screen stream setup, so a computer, because I'm using my laptop right now. I'm hoping to get a desktop computer, a new webcam, and a new headset, because this broke on stream a bit ago, and I had to tape it to fix it. So, um, thank you guys, and I shall see you all in my next stream. Love you, and see you next time. Bye-bye! Oh, wait. Star Screamer like to say good. Bye, foolish humans! <laughs> Bye! Okay, I bought this ass pillow for myself for when I sit on my chair. And, uh, apparently Kitty also likes it too. Because <laughs> every time I get my ass up, she wants to sit in it. Kitty! Kitty! Did you get a nap? Yeah, she's like completely asleep. <laughs> Why do you always steal my chair, Katie? Why? <laughs>